This lesson introduces parabolas and graphing of parabolas. A parabola is a conic section. Slicing a cone with a plane parallel to the cone results in a parabola. The focus of a parabola is a point in the plane. The directrix is a line in the plane not containing the focus. The parabola is a set of points equidistant from the focus and directrix. For example, I'll plot a couple of points on this parabola that, that are equidistant from the focus and the directrix. The vertex is the point on the parabola that is closest to the focus, and here we'll say the distance from the focus to the vertex is absolute value of P. That will be the same as the distance from the vertex to the directrix. The lattice rectum is the line segment parallel to the directrix, which contains the focus. And one thing to note about the lattice rectum, its length is the absolute value of 4p. That will help us in graphing to have a more accurate sketch of our parabolas. A vertical parabola can either open up or down. The standard equation for a vertical parabola is x minus h squared equals 4p times y minus k, where the vertex is hk. If p is greater than 0, the parabola opens upwards. If p is less than 0, the parabola opens downwards. A horizontal parabola has the standard equation y minus k squared equals 4p times x minus h with vertex hk. If p is greater than 0, the parabola opens to the right. And if p is less than 0, a horizontal parabola opens to the left. Let's sketch a graph of the parabola y minus 2 squared equals negative 4 times x plus 1. And I will start by noticing that this parabola opens either to the right or to the left because y is the squared term here. And because of that negative 4 in front of the x plus 1, my 4p will be equal to negative 4. And so p will equal negative 1, which means that the graph will open to the left. Okay, so what do we need to know to sketch this parabola? We need to first look for the vertex. So to find the vertex, notice that I have x minus h. My h, my h for the vertex will be negative 1. And for the y value of the vertex, I have y minus 2. And so k here will be equal to 2. So my vertex is at negative 1, 2. And the next thing I'll look for is the focus. Well, the focus with a p-value of negative 1 and the parabola opening to the left, I will go one unit to the left of my vertex to find the focus. So the focus will be the point here of negative 2, 2. Okay, and we might know that the directrix is the line one unit to the right of the vertex. So here the directrix will be the y-axis, or we'll call it the line x equals 0. Okay, I'm almost ready to sketch this graph, but one other thing to note, if I plot the endpoints of the lattice rectum, that will help me get a better graph. So from the focus, remember p is equal to negative 1, so I'm going to go two units down from the focus and two units up from the focus. That gives me a total length of four times the absolute value of p here. And so then I'll plot the points of the parabola, or I'll sketch a quick graph here. And it will look like so. Try on your own, graph the parabola x minus 1 squared equals negative 8 times y plus 3. 